Today we're talking all about the bog bag and comparing it to Simple Modern's take on the bog bag. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Nicole. And if you're new here on this page, I share all of my favorite things from handbags, fun finds for the family and more. So if you're new here, definitely consider subscribing. I am a self-proclaimed bog bag fan. I have the big bog bag, the little bog bag. And when I saw Simple, Mo Simple Modern come out with a more affordable version of the bog bag, they also eliminate some of the pain points that we have with the bog bag. I was first to sign up. So today I wanted to walk you through a direct comparison of Simple Modern's take on the bog bag. I have all the items packed inside this bag and then we're gonna take them, move them over to the bog so you can see exactly how they pack up. This bog bag is the original size, which is the largest size that they offer. I have had mine for two years now. Looks like this. Most of my accessories I grabbed just off of Etsy. I'll be sure to link all of them in the show notes down below. But this is the big original size. I do also have the baby bog and I have the bitty bog. But let's do a direct comparison between these two. Let's jump right in. Okay, let's get started talking about the dimensions of these two bags so you can get a really good feel for how they're similar and how they are different. Starting with the height of the bag. The bog bag is 15 inches tall and the simple modern one is 11.75. So you can see the difference right here. And when it comes to how open they are across the top of the bag, the bog bag is 9.5 inches. Mine is actually stretched out over time because I've had mine for like three, two, three years now. So mine's a little stretchy, but when they come brand new, they are 9.5 inches open. And the simple modern one is 11 inches. So that one is going, the simple modern one is going to have a wider open on it um, and slightly shorter. And to get a better idea of what that looks like, let me just spin them sideways. So you can see, you can see the simple modern one is larger when it comes to the width of the bag. And then when we look at across the top of the bag, so this measurement right here, which goes across that one on the bog bag is going to be 19 inches and it's going to be 18.5 inches on the simple modern. So pretty close. Let me give you a quick overhead. Look at that. There's a quick aerial look. Both bags are made from the same material, which is EVA. It is waterproof, it's washable, it can go in the sand with you. These are perfect beach and pool bags. I cannot stress that enough. When you get home or when you're done at the beach, all you have to do is just hose it down. It is so awesome. The strap drop on each bag is different though, however. On the bog bag, it is 10 inches from the top of the strap to the bag. And this little strap is 0.75 inches wide if that makes a difference to you. The strap on the Simple Modern bag has a drop of 12 inches and is one full inch wide. Let me show you really quickly what both bags look like when I'm holding them. Here you go, there's Simple Modern and there's the bog bag. And you'll notice that they took probably every bog bag owner's biggest paid point, the strap, <laughs> If you've had a bog bag, you know how they get tangled and twisted and they get so crazy. And they alleviated our headaches by putting the strap on this little swivel so you don't have to mess with any of that. Both bags also have a slip-proof non-skid bottom. This is what the bottom of the bog bag looks like. Looks kind of like a tire. And if I tip the simple modern one upside down, you can see the bottom of that one. A lot of little dots in this kind of fun pattern. I think aesthetically, this is really a lot prettier but non-slip non nonetheless. One other thing I'll mention is bog bag has been around for many years now and last couple of years, it's been all the craze. So you have people on Etsy making all kinds of things, phone holders and little things to customize it. Um, I do wanna let you know that most of them do fit. So here's an example of a little sunglass holder um, or a key holder. This little bit does fit in the bog bag. Obviously that's what it's made for but it does also fit in the simple modern bag too. I will say I have a really cool tray that does not work in the simple modern bag. Um, it's a little divider that turns into a tray that only works in the bog bag because the bog bag is basically just a big rectangle. <laughs> you can see it's just like one big rectangle. This simple modern bag kind of tapers at the bottom. 
so it's rounded at the bottom. You'll see what I mean when I take everything out. Um, but let me show you how I have this packed up and then we'll move all the same contents over to the bog and you can see how much room more or less the bog bag has too. Let's do it. I did want to mention that both bags do also come with these little pouches. This is the simple modern one. It can also just clip right out if you want. And then it has what looks like to be a waterproof zipper. And that is a bigger size than the one that comes with the bog bag. I think I do kind of like theirs just a bit better. The material feels a lot more sturdy. It's more of that like rubbery plastic. See how it kind of tapers off at the corners? It's rounded, so it's not just like big flat rectangle like the bog bag is. And so here is the bog bag all packed up with the same exact items. Like I said, mine is a little bit stretched out because we've used it so much, which I don't really mind, but let's just pretend that it's not. And this is what it would look like. Kind of tip it forward so you guys can see. You can see that there's still space right here. I like packing the bags to the max, so I would probably toss my water bottle in there and we would be good to go. So there you go. That's what the bog bag looks like. Okay, I went ahead and I moved everything over. And as you can see, it's a little bit of a tight fit on the Simple Modern bag, I'm not gonna lie. I'm kind of like squeezing this bottle down in there and the fan is kind of squished over on this other side. So you can tell that it is just a bit smaller than the bog bag, but let me tell you, when it comes in at price points, I don't think I mentioned at the beginning of the video, the bog bag, it does come in tons of colors, more than 20 different colors. It's $89.99 and the simple modern bag retails for $59.99. It has been on sale recently for $50.99. So it is, in my opinion, a $30 difference is a pretty big difference. And to get rid of the pain point of the spinning handles, um, I kind of I kind of love that, I'm not gonna lie. I will say that because I've been using the bog bag for years now, I am accustomed to packing up this bag. <laughs> and I feel comfortable knowing how to modularly pack everything so that everything just fits perfect. And I do love having extra space. So if I had to pick between the two, I probably would stay with my bog just because I know that, that little bit of extra space I can fill with a towel or snacks or something else. And here I'm really squished to the maximum on the simple modern bag, just because it is just a little bit smaller. But there is a quick comparison of the two bags. I hope this was helpful for you guys as you are going on your summer vacations and you're trying to decide what bag to take and what's gonna work best for you. I don't think you could go wrong either way. You know your family and how much space you need and what you need to pack with you, but both are awesome. Love them, I love sharing them with you today. All right, everybody, so that is it for the video today. I hope that you found it helpful. If you did, be sure to hit that like button, subscribe and stay a while, and I'll see all of you guys again in my next video. Bye, guys.